It is the perfect time of year to grab a book and head to the beach. Elsie Souza from Bookstore One in Sarasota is here to help us make our summer reading lists. And Elsie, you say all of these books are to die for. <laughs> What's the theme? <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> So I always say to die for, for everything. It's like <laughs> anyone who knows me knows that. But seriously, the, uh, we do book clubs during the summertime in the st store. You know, people live here all year round. It's not just a wintertime kind of thing, as all of us know. And so these books are attached to book clubs that we actually have in at Bookstore One mm -hmm. during the summer. So do you encourage everyone, I've never done a book club and I feel like I need to try, do you encourage them to read the book well before they get there? Or, or Yes, okay. absolutely. Come to the store, they're on the shelves, they're in a very select location, purchase the book, you know, read it at your leisure and home and then come to, to the store and enjoy, you know, our book club. So. I don't make this intimidating for people. People are intimidated when yes. they're reading yes. and they don't feel very comfortable about coming to a book club because mm. they think they might not know enough mm -hmm, about it mm -hmm. or right. whatever, but that's not the intent. It's to come in. It's a social kind of a oh. thing too. So And you've given us cool. a little bit of time. This next book club is Tuesday, July 17th. And mm -hmm. of course that is at Bookstore One. And the first book that you're featuring on today's list uh, is part of that? Yes, it's under the harrow and it's by um, Flynn Berry, and it won the Edgar Award, which is the highest award that any mystery writer can, can earn in the United States. Mm. And so it's the story, it's a psychological thriller you would love. Oh, I love it. You love it already. <laughs> and it's a story about two sisters and what happens to their lives. And to win that award, let me tell you, you have to be good. Wow. So that's what we're featuring. Oh, great. All right. What's so next? besides Mysteries to Die For Our Book Club, we also have Lost in Translation. Oh. I, I love translations from, um, you know, from different languages into English. And this one here is a Nobel Prize winner, and it is the Occupation Trilogy, and it's by Patrick Modiani. And he is famous for writing about um, France during World War II. And the French is still grappling with what happened during the war, and he has become the conscience of France. Oh. So it's very intriguing, mm -hmm. and people will, will enjoy it. Oh. So then in August, we're featuring Peter May, who has become a favorite of Bookstore One, and he, our book that's being featured is The Firemaker, and The Firemaker is set in China. Oh. It's a story about a detective who meets a forensic pathologist and their interrelationship. Well, it's getting better and better. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> Linda wants all of these books. I can I tell know, this is right exactly. up her alley. And so then we, we head to Turkey for Lost in Translation, and Orhan Pamuk is um, the most famous of the Turkish authors that we know here in America, and it's called My Name is Red. It's the story of um, the Sultan, and he decides he wants a book translated and he finds some people who are going to do it, and it's really a great, you would like this one too. Oh, somebody gets <laughs> killed. There we go, there we go. <laughs> then um, we'll be featuring Time is a Killer by Michelle Boussy, who's a famous French author, and um, it literally is the story of, it's a thriller, oh, and good. it's set in Corsica, oh, so yeah. we have all this intrigue cool. going on. And then the last one will be Chronicle of the Murdered House, by Lucio Cardoza, it's set in Brazil, and it's the story about this family and how it evolves through the, the years, and obviously there's a murder in Somebody the Somebody gets killed. <laughs> yep. So those are the books we're featuring, and a special thing we do in the summertime at Bookstore One, we feature self-published authors hmm. every Thursday, right starting on, in July, right through the end of September, and we're very proud to feature people who have self-published a book mm -hmm. cool. and it's something that we we give to the community so come in and join oh, us. How do you yeah. choose? Mm -hmm. So they so this is what happens so okay. they submit their their names and their information and frankly I don't go crazy overseeing the, the content of the mm -hmm. book as much as is the focus on them and the fact that they published a self-published mm -hmm. book and then we choose the names, and there they go. And for some of them, it's the first time they've ever been involved in any kind of a, 
an author event. So it's oh. very exciting. Oh, yes. And their friends come and visit, and sometimes they bring food, and it's just a great oh, time. Oh, my. Yeah, oh, it's, very, it's a party. It's so, a party. All right, so the first book that you featured is the one that will be featured in this upcoming book club. Right. Any advice for someone who is looking to, to come to the book club for the first time? Well, I just say come and, and you know, just come and enjoy. Read the book, obviously. Even if you've read part of the book, you just just to come and experience, you know, and we have a core group of people who come to the book clubs. And, you know, we not only, obviously, we talk about the book, but then we discuss life <laughs> 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 and what's going on in Sarasota. Yeah. And a lot of them go to lunch after because we hold them at 11 a.m. So it's a great time and having 93 restaurants downtown. Yes. Everyone's focused on going to lunch after. So yeah, just so enjoy. It seems yeah. like a great idea if you loved the book or if you're even struggling with the book there that you, you have a group of people that it, can e maybe help you Yeah, you learn through. new things about and it. And some people do not like the book yes. and they're very vocal. And that's okay that. too, right? There you go. All right. There you go. I, what a great idea, what a great thing to do for the summer. Uh, you can find these books and many more at Bookstore One on Palm Avenue right here in downtown Sarasota, or you can go to their website for the full list of events and authors that will be coming. Go to sarasotabooks.com.